Deep budget cuts at the National Institutes of Health have endangered biomedical research in the United States and slowed momentum for finding new treatments and cures for some of the world's deadliest diseases. As a result of sequestration, the NIH budget will be cut by $1.6 billion. Accordingly, NIH's ability to sustain current grant making and encourage promising new areas of research is significantly compromised. As the world's largest professional society dedicated to the causes and treatments of blood disorders, the American Society of Hematology is committed to the long-term goal of sustaining hematology research. Currently, science, and particularly the NIH, is not being well-funded. And this is translated to a difficulty for researchers to continue their careers. And we saw this as a problem for our workforce, that dedicated persons that had creative and innovative ideas about blood diseases and blood cancers and how they develop, about how to translate those ideas into therapies for patients, and then how to implement them in patient care, had their research um, impacted. And we wanted to do something important and helpful for them at this time. And that was the impetus for starting a bridge grant funding program. So we put $9 million into funding a three-year program with the intent to give 30 grants each year of $100,000 uh, to our scientists. And institutions where they're at will contribute $50,000. So the total grant is $150,000 per person. The Bridge Grant Program engages members as program designers and grant reviewers, and will fund at least 90 scientists who are doing research in diseases ranging from blood cancers, such as leukemia, lymphoma, and myeloma, to clotting disorders to sickle cell anemia. Recognizing that more needs to be done to preserve funding for NIH, the Society has also launched a national advocacy and communications campaign to educate policymakers and the American public about the importance of supporting biomedical research. Science is critical to our economic growth, it's critical to our workforce, it's critical to innovation, and it's critical for establishing cures for patients with blood diseases and blood cancers. And because of this need, um, we thought that it was important at a difficult economic time when the NIH was not funded well to support our workforce. For its leadership in the fight for biomedical research funding, ASAE is proud to recognize the American Society of Hematology with a 2013 Summit Award.